Hey dolls, hey cuties, it's BB Dolly here again, and this is my part two of my makeup haul from you now. So let's get started. Okay, so I went to Vietnam and I got some really nice makeup brush sets, and they're really nice. For this brush set, I got was this LB brush set. Really, really nice. Inside looks like that. And they have really nice brushes, and the brushes are so soft. Oh yeah, these are how the brushes look like. I'm like missing one brush here. I don't know what happened to it. I was using this set earlier today, so it's probably somewhere I can't find it. So yeah, this is the first brush set. And then I also bought this really nice brush set. And this one is from A2. It's a Korean brand. And it's like this. This brush set, I love. This is my favorite brush set. I bought this brush set for pretty expensive. Probably I think that I brought this I bought this brush set for like uh $50. Well, that's pretty expensive too over there because everything in Asia is usually really cheap. But I bought a really nice high quality brush set. I haven't even used this yet. Really, really nice. They also have like, yeah, those really nice brushes. And they're so soft. And these little things right here, they're lip brushes. So, you use them for your lips. So yeah, that's the first brush set. And it's just like that. This E2 right here. Made in Korea. And then you just tie it. And then last but not least, got this really nice gold brush set. Also really nice. And also kind of pricey too. And I think this one's also by E2, the Korean one too. But this one's just gold. And this is how the brush set looks like. I think there's 24 brushes in this one, and same with the one that I just showed you earlier. So, really nice brushes. Oh, they have really nice, the brushes like thick, very, very soft. So, yeah, loving it. So, this will really come in handy for me for makeup school. So, yeah. So that's all the makeup brushes uh, that I got in those sets. Now going on to some other makeup I got. So uh, I went to the duty free shops um, at Taipei Airport, which is Taiwan Airport. And they sell cosmetics and everything like branding cosmetics. It was really nice. And I got some Giorgio Armani blushes. And they are so pretty. Okay. So I got first blush, it's like really nice pink blush. And these are really nice because, you know, regular MAC blushes and everything, they're small. But this one is big. It's like a mineralized skin finish. It's big like an MSF. So that's really nice. And this one, um, it kind of looks the same, but it's a little bit different. This one is a little bit more pink. And the other one is like a little bit more reddish orange. And then the next blush I got was a really really light pink one and all these have like marble veinings in it so really really nice really high being pigmented let me just swatch one for you guys okay that bottom one you see that yeah that's a blush really really pretty I love it and then oh yeah I got an Annie Sui blush this is the only thing I ever own from Anna. From the Anna brand. And it looks, this is like a blush. And this one is called, oh it's not really called, they don't have a name, but it's number 350. And it's a blush. And it looks like that. The blush is so tiny, but the brush is like, ooh, super soft. And you know what? You see that print of roses in there? It really does smell like roses. So you know when you go outside and you have like a rose garden? Smells so much like it. Love it. 
and it's sad because I only own one thing from Anna. But I love their stuff. But we don't have it here in Canada that much. Okay, and other stuff that I got from Giorgio Armani is eyeshadows. And then this one I got is brown shades of eyeshadows. It's kind of dirty. Because um, it was like in my suitcase and everything, so it was like messed up. Next one I got, uh, this one's probably my favorite. It's like Midnight Blue Eyeshadow Palette. It's so pretty. It's like these really gorgeous blue colors. So really nice for a smoky blue eye. And then I have Purple Eyeshadow Quad. It looks like that. Pretty! Even though um, these makeup on the duty free shops are a bit expensive, the thing is, there's no tax. That's why it's called duty free, because there's no tax, right? So, yeah, I got all this without tax, so that's why I got it in like every color. This one is a smoky palette, or a smoky quad, whatever you want to call it. Then, I got this. This one's my favorite, too. It's kind of like a pink quad, and it has like mauvey plum colors. Really, really pretty for the fall. Then, last but not least, oh, this is how the box looks like. Last but not least, I got, ooh, I got this eyeshadow palette. And I'm not going to take the plastic off. It's because this thing broke when I brought it back. I'm so pissed off. Okay, look. Yeah, it broke. You see that? It broke. So, here's the eyeshadow on. <gasps> Oops, sorry for the language, but the eyeshadow broke. Uh, and this is my favorite palette, too. Well, even though I say I, I like the other ones, but this one is, like, really nice because they have gold and, like, that really nice rich brown that broke right there. So I'm kind of sad. Haven't even used it. And, like, it was in my suitcase, so I don't know how. It just broke. Okay. So, yeah, what else did I get? And I got this really nice uh, Elesme. It's like a Japanese um, eyebrow powder. So they have really nice shades. So yeah. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty much part my part two of my makeup haul. If you haven't already watched my part one, I'll put a link to the sidebar so you guys can go check it out. So yeah, if you guys haven't already subscribed to me, please do so on the side. And if you guys have any questions or comments whatsoever about this video or anything, then let me know, okay? I'll see you guys in my next video. I'll be doing more hauls soon. Bye-bye!